Flamey Hotman, a short update video for you today with some potentially disappointing news for you Avatar fans. Earlier this week, reports started leaking that Netflix live action Avatar The Last Airbender series has been delayed. You see, the original plan was for season one of Netflix live action Avatar The Last Airbender to drop around summer 2023, but according to reports, it's now looking like the show is going to be pushed back to a 2024 release, with a small possibility of a late 2023 release at the earliest. So it's definitely looking like summer 2023 is out of the picture now. These reports are based on an unnamed inside source at Netflix sharing some inside news, but it does definitely seem believable, and I'll explain why. A few weeks ago, I shared some insight from Firelord Ozai actor Daniel Day Kim, who said that the show was still in VFX post-production. Obviously, still being in post-production and working on VFX when your show was due to release in just a few months already suggests that the show was going to be late. Also, that's the only bit of news we've really had from anyone involved in the project. You see, Netflix haven't really released any formal news, they haven't released any trailers, not even a poster. And that's significant because even for One Piece, which is due in the summer, they've released a poster and some little teasers, but there's been nothing for Netflix Avatar The Last Airbender. And they've never actually given a release date for the live action Avatar The Last Airbender either. So that alone should be evidence that summer 2023 is now looking very optimistic for us to get this live action series that we've all been waiting for. You might be wondering why has it been delayed? Well, there are a couple of reasons behind it. Firstly, it looks like the VFX is taking longer than expected. According to Avatar News, it's not due to issues with the story or having anything to do with reshoots or changing the story. So hopefully that's a good thing. If you remember, this live action Avatar The Last Airbender is using the same VFX technology as The Mandalorian, and it's a technology that no other Netflix show has really used on this scale to date. So it's kind of understandable why the VFX and post-production might be taking slightly longer. From a personal point of view, I prefer that they do take a little bit of extra time to make sure the show looks good and it flows, rather than just trying to get it out quickly and it's looking really bad. Oh yeah, it's not the bending either, according to Avatar News, which is hopefully another good sign because I am really optimistic about the bending being good after seeing the stunt team's work in the tough shorts they did. The other reason that this show could be delayed is actually just because Netflix has a full slate for summer 2023 and indeed the rest of 2023. There are so many shows on the way. Henry Cavill's last season in The Witcher season 3 is due to drop around summer 2023. You've got Bridgerton coming later in 2023. You've got the last season of Cobra Kai coming later in 2023, you've got Emily in Paris, you've got the live action One Piece series which could be really big, plus so many more series all due in 2023. So it might just be that they don't feel they need to rush Avatar The Last Airbender because they've got enough on their plate to release in 2023. So again hopefully that's a good sign because they're just taking more time to make sure it's actually good rather than just trying to get it out there. The final thing I should say is that I've been saying delayed a lot in this video, technically Netflix haven't actually set a release date. So in reality, it's only delayed in terms of the date we thought it would arrive, but from a Netflix point of view, I guess it's not actually delayed. I will do my best to keep you updated though as things develop, because I know like me, lots of you are excited to see this live action Avatar The Last Airbender series. For now though, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll catch you later.